at the Frisco Adventure Park. We're in Frisco, so in the center of the county. After a short break. We had a little bit of a hiatus because lack of snow. Zach Wade with the Summit County Rescue Group says with a return of snow comes a return to the Frisco Beacon Park. Really good place for people to come and practice. Where people can turn on buried transceivers. Control panel to turn on all the beacons. And practice searching for them in a pretend avalanche debris field. We're getting close to uh, the buried transceivers and then practicing your probing. Skills that this you know, season if you want to practice a multiple burial are more scenario. important than ever. Good to get out and practice early. Because not only has there been a lot of snow, there's also been a lot of wind. Two ingredients that's got avalanche danger across the state on the rise. Slabs forming on top, which is the combination for avalanches. Because in recent weeks, search teams in Summit County have seen more avalanches more often. Over the past couple of weeks, we've had a lot of close calls in Summit County with skier, snowboarder triggered avalanches already. And it's why this park is back open and will be all season. It'll be here until spring. So people can practice skills that Zach says can save lives in the backcountry. Rescuing your partners that you're out traveling in the backcountry with yourself is the surest way that you'll actually save them. Avalanche danger across much of western Colorado is considerable right now, which means on some slopes it's fairly easy to trigger avalanches. So work in these parks is pretty important. The idea is to do it quickly. Look for those transceivers. They don't want you to dig them up, leave them buried, so the next group of people that come through can look for them as well. But Jordan and Corey, so important right now, especially if you spend time in the backcountry, because rescuing those people in your group is the best way you're going to save them because it's all about time. Yeah, this is something Something we'd recommend if anybody does plan to have the backcountry, they're definitely going to want to test these skills out there, Matt. Yeah, and, and it's a perfect place to do it right here in the middle of Summit County, right next to the Frisco Adventure Park. It's easy to get to. They have parking here, and so you can just come out here, practice those skills, see how fast you can do it, because again, it's that speed that's going to save someone's life in the backcountry. And that's why whether you're new to it or you're a seasoned backcountry skier, it's always good to keep your Absolutely. skills sharp for sure. All right, well, really great that they're opening that back up. Matt, thank you.